Alright, Mad Tater X here, and welcome back to the Darkest Dungeon. Uh, so, we're about to go do another mission here. I think this time we're going to go into the Warrens. And I got a crew here with us. I want to bring out Durandal here, the Seeker of Abomination. I think that he's going to be pretty good. He does have Dud Hitter, so he's got minus 3% crit if hit points below 50%, plus 20% stress if the torch is below 26. Shouldn't be a problem. I plan on keeping the torch high. Uh, he's got a couple other quirks here. We are actually venturing into the Warden, so that's not really going to help him too much. She's sickly, minus 10% disease resist, plus 20% stress and ruins, unyielding though. I hope none of this really comes into play. Now, th with her, I actually did purchase Iron Swan. So I'm going to get rid of that in favor of Iron Swan so we have some more damage on the back row. I'm going to have Barbaric Yop for a stun, we have Bleed, and we just have Wicked Hack. Now we've got uh, Jubert here, he's a bad gambler, won't come into effect. Um, I really want to get rid of this and the Tuckered Out, so we're going to have to work on that. Now, again, he's got a bunch of skills that really aren't going to come into play. I'm mainly bringing him in here for, again, we got some back row targets, which <coughs> I don't know if I like this too terribly much. But he does have the heal, the vulnerability hex, and the demon's pull to hopefully get some stuff up front for our heavy hitters. Uh, the heal is primarily why he's here. Also, he works tandem with the... Well, the abomination here. Now, another thing that I was looking at is I wanted to bring him for the ability to get rid of the blights and the bleeds that may happen without having to use some items. Maybe we can save a little bit of money there. He does have e the stun shuffle, but I was actually thinking about bringing this. Again, it's another target for the last two rows, so we have a lot of a lot of back row targeting capabilities here. Um, this is going to be a double stun compared to the single stun. I'm not sure which one I would prefer. I think I may actually go with the single stun. I don't know. But I do have that option available, so we can kind of take a look at it for what it is. This one clears corpses too, so it's going to bring more stuff to the front for our, our heavy hitters. Uh, he's got more blight that he can bring, and this here, this, this leeches, as you know from the last episode, we have a ton of problem with diseases. This guy even has the wasting sickness. Now, what I went ahead and did before I started looking at this stuff here is I went to the sanitarium, I unlocked another slot, and I did commit some of our people that have uh, big disease problems, and it says it can possibly remove more than one, so I'm kind of banking on that. I hope it does happen. Um, I really want to do this. It looks like the best trinket. I was coming over here, we got plus 5 accuracy, plus 2 dodge for anyone. Over here it's a plus 4 dodge, plus 1 speed, minus 20 debuff resistance for the Houndmaster. I don't really have a Houndmaster yet, but also here I don't have a Leper. But plus 15% damage, minus 3% virtue chance. If in position 1, I think all around that's going to be better, and since I haven't been into the coves yet, rather go with something that I'm more experienced with why I'm still trying to get my team all up and done. Now, this entire team doesn't really have any stress recovery, so that may be a big problem. We may have to deal with a lot of stress coming out of this, uh, utilizing our, our stress relieving opportunities here, like the Abbey and the Tavern, instead of actually curing our stress in there. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I haven't really done trinkets on these guys yet, so let's take a look and see if there's going to be anything that could be helpful. 25 versus human. I don't think we're going to fight very many humans. Minus 2 dodge. What is his dodge? His dodge is 7. Plus 20% disease resist. That might actually be useful. Move skills chance. Minus 1 speed. Nothing really except for maybe that. So let's go back over here. He's got the... Plus 40% disease resist. We want that in there. We don't want any more people getting diseased if possible. Everything else is kind of meh. On him. Oh. We already have one of these items. Well, this may change us entirely on what we're going to do. I didn't even know that. Uh, anyway, he doesn't have really much anything that we can put in here either. We're kind of short on 
trinkets. We need to get some more. So let's rethink this. Since we already have one of these, that means the wheel, plus five accuracy, minus two dodge, or the co. We can go for this. I mean, can this team handle a co? Let's find out. All right, complete 100% of room battles. And that seems like it could be dangerous. Um, the cove, the cove. Let's see. Um, not really what I was looking for. I'm trying to see if there's more explanations of the cove. Oh well. <coughs> To fish, fish, fish. Okay, provisions. Let's do it. Let's go with our H torches. Uh, um, I think that's taking too much food. If we find hunger tiles, it's going to use four a piece. Let's do 10, just in case. Let's bring in two shovels. I want three bandages, one key, one buffy pot, and one herb. Just in case we find some things to interact with, I want to try to figure more of that stuff out. And I got an anti-venom. I think would be good. He has the ability to do all of this. I just... I don't know if I'm overspending here. Oh well, you know what? Better safe than sorry. Let's go ahead and embark. Tentacled lurkers lie in wait just below the water's surface. Tread carefully. Alright, we will do that. We will definitely be treading carefully in the cove and figuring out what exactly type of beasties we have These to deal with here. These soaked caverns are teeming with pelagic nightmares. They must be flushed out. All right, so this doesn't look too bad. <clears throat> Not too bad at all. So, who knows? It could be over pretty quickly. We could just die a horrible death. What's this? Another oh, ready using a shovel. Another misfortune. All oh, right, maybe I didn't bring enough shovels. We'll find out very soon. Oh, look. Well, thank you. The extra shovel might come in. All right, we got fishmen. Oh, they're surprised. We're good, good, good there. Okay, so let's have a look-see. Hmm, okay. So these guys, they uh, look pretty tough versus bleed, but everything else, they're kind of okay. Dodge five, speed six. So we know they're quick and they're a little bit dodgy. So they're all the same. Hmm. That's a good way to start this. Well, that's only going to hit one. This is going to get rid of some of that dodge. I think I like that play. Hmm, sound effects seem a bit loud here. Hold on. Uh, audio, sound effects. Let's turn that down a bit. And we can hopefully uh, stop those horrible noises from coming through like that. All right, so we got this guy here. He has his own heal, as well as a transform. Hmm. He probably needs to move back. Looks like these two I'm going to have to switch. He changes into a beast, gets a little bit more damage, but adds stress to everyone. We don't want to be doing that just yet. Hmm. Matter of fact, I think it's a good idea just to swap him right now. Okay. We are going to go for a stun. Let's stun the back guy here. I'll move him to the front. And let's just go ahead and hack this marked target. Spear fishing. Three points. Stun's removed, and seaward slash dodge. Nice dodge. I like it when that happens. Okay. 
So now we seem to be in a better spot, I think. Let's go ahead and stun this guy here. I want to go for the kill. Ooh. That's okay. We actually have uh, things for that. Um, that's going to be good here. It's still only going to hit one. I could start to stay up on the heels. We could just pull him back forward. Yeah, let's give that a shot. Hi, buddy. Ooh, five. All right, we're still in an okay spot. Ooh, eight. Eight is bad. I don't like eight. Okay, we do have another stun, but I really think you should heal some of that damage. Eight was brutal. Confidence him. surges as the enemy crumbles. Spear fishing on the back line. Ooh, five. All right, so we are going to have to start staying up on top of these heals. Um. I could start going for some damage on them, but I do like the stun game that we're playing with. Oh, bring them back up. Thank you. All right. Oh, I stunned the wrong one. I need to pay more attention to that. The one who's attacked, I should definitely try to stun the other one. You are still in a bad way, so go ahead and heal yourself some more. I guess you're just going to be tanking for a little while. Um, Their bleed resistance is pretty high, so let's just go ahead and... You're going to have stun resistance next turn, so yeah, let's start killing you, and we can get the other guy stunned. Phew, let's go ahead and start topping people off. Good, resisted the bleed. Stun, you're going to go right? Oh, no. Okay. Excellent. Let's, um, let's give you a nice heal. A seven. So good. Oh, got the bleed, though, so we'll point for three rounds. Um... What is your stun resistance now? 50%. What is this chance? 100. So 50-50 shot to stun here. Let's take it. Resisted. Not good. Um. Hmm. Yeah, let's do the stun shuffle. Precision and power. Got it. Nice stress relief here too. You bleed. You're good. You're good. You're good. Let's take him. Oh, bad dodge. All right, stun. Prevents his action. Going on to the next turn. Um, heal yourself. Good job. All right, both of these guys have stun resistance now. Two point blight damage. How many hit points do you have left? Two. The Let's do it. Quakes. All right, so we got the blight two points. He should be dead. And let's go ahead and remove that bleed. A death by inches. Okay, we're going for him again. Ow! Okay, nine points of damage here. This guy's going down this round. Let's go ahead. And zero. You're in a bad place because of that zero heal. Man. Take care of yourself, buddy. Looks like that's going to be your job this entire match is healing yourself. <laughs> Destroy. Alright, so we did get a bandage out of this. We got some more crests and some food. I'm happy with this. The food, the food, the food. What can we do with that? You're a little off in a bad way. Let's go ahead and eat that. What's our rooms look like? I think we have plenty of torches, so we can afford to use a torch per room. In Radiance, may we find victory. Ooh. Stress wave. Fifteen stress. Okay. Spear fishing. We already know you. Seven. Ow. Okay. Um. Hmm. Hmm, let me think here. I have an idea. Let's hit you with a stun. Seven. God, these guys hit hard. Shocker. Resist. Debuff. Yeah, barbaric yaw. The triple stun is good. I want this guy up front if at all possible. Thank you. And we 
we've already got a stun on pretty much everybody. Let's get a free round if we can. Back to the back. Nice. Hmm, I think now is a good time to do this. So cool. Ugh, stress. Alright, um... Rake is gonna do 4 to 8 on him and 4 to 8 on him. Not quite enough to kill. This is gonna do 7 to 13. So it's possible this will kill him. And then we got Slam. 5 to 10, 5 to 10. So let's go with the one that might kill. Or we could just miss completely. That works too. Um, you've got 50% stun resistance. Let's go for the Blight. Yes, we got it. How many hit points do you have? You've got 8 left. I really need to start healing. Heal yourself, my friend. I wanted to pull him forward to try to kill, but I think the swan may have it. As yes. the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Excellent. So we got that off. So that's perfect. So we don't, we're not going to pile up any more stress from there. Um, plus 15 damage from skill rake. So I guess every time I rake, it gets more powerful. Alright. Salty gouge. Three. Nice resist. Top her off. Three. There he is. Ugh. Negated. Um. You are dead. You are not. Hmm. What's the play here? He's got 5 points, 10% blight resistance. This may do it. Yeah, you're dead. And 9 points here. 8! Ow! The slow dead. death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Alright, I think we're good here. Transform. And you need to take care of yourself in a bad way. Man, gotta get hit again. Eight! Alright, I need something good here, man. Ten. That is decent. We can live with that. Ow. Right, take him out. Disadvantage. Give them no quarter. And top her off, can take care of that bleed. Great We're still is the weapon that cuts on its own. Quite a bit of stress. We've got golds and portraits here. All right. Hmm. Should I use the key this early? I don't think so. Ooh. All right. Got some more heirlooms for. Upgrading some stuff. Uh, let's move forward. Keep a close lookout for. I guess I missed the trap. <laughs> Ancient traps uh, lie in wait. Wow, that's a lot of Unspun stress. And thirsting for blood. Why is it so much stress? That's not good. Heirlooms. Wealth beyond measure, awarded to the brave so, and the foolhardy alike. I was thinking without stress relief we would have a little bit of stress but these guys are stressed the fuck out man it's bad they're like super stressed oh what's this a tank guardian mm, two spear fishers and that guy <sighs> I think I need to focus up. So first off, we're gonna try to stun this guy. And I wanna do as much damage to this guy back here as humanly possible. He's got four and no blight resistance. 
I think we go for the double blight and bank on it killing him. Alright, he's gonna die. Um... I really want to pull one of those guys to the front, but I need to heal. Ah, oh, These heals for zero are brutal, man. Slowly. Gently. This is how a life done. is taken. You're gonna get to go. You're gonna spearfish back here for three. I'm okay with that. That was good. Barnacle barrier. Uh, okay. What's the play here? They haven't gone yet. You have stun resistance. So let's stun you. And I think you're gonna die from bleed. Seven. Their formation is Good. broken. Maintain the offensive. What? This guy here has a high bleed resistance, no blight resistance. So we're just gonna go for. You know what? I actually like this play better. Double stun. I'm happy with that. And. Yeah, let's try to get some blight on him. And you need to make good with these heals. I'm starting not to like you. Alright, we're starting to get a little bit of damage on him. This guy is no longer guarded. Let's get some blight on you if we can. That looks good. Alright, let's uh... Hmm. Stack up more blight on you, if we can. Eight damage per round. He's got 21 hit points left. You need to make good with these heals. Thank you. Four points aren't too bad. Resist oh, it has a bleed attached to it. Okay. Um, we yopped before, so she's got to be debuffed. She doesn't do a lot of damage now. He is going to bleed for 8. We need to do 4 points of damage. This does 3 to 7. It's kind of a gamble. 4, we got it! Okay, um... You, your stun resistance is 50%. I think it's worth it to stop the damage if it hits. Perfect. Alright, so now we're in a great spot here. I want you to go ahead and heal yourself. Start topping some stuff off. You, you hit him. Ah, oh, you missed. At least we got the stun. We're good. All right, back to you. Yeah, still top her up. Nice, 12. So I think the zero is, it can happen, but it has a higher chance of getting some really good ones too. All right, we got a bleed here. That needs to be taken care of. I thought you were dead. You got one hit point. You're dead this round. I Math, wrong. Um, how many? You got six, and you're bleeding for two? Yeah, we got this. Alright, so you can heal yourself. We're good here. You, blight. Now you're at six damage, you have four life. You're taking four damage, you have one life. We're all good here. I wish I had another option. Um, yeah. Might as well. Let's top yourself off for one. And you bled. Ooh. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. Alright. So you can go on the occultist immediately. Oh, we're done. We're done? There's only one room battle? That's it? Two rooms? Uh, fish idol. Um... Let's see, fish idol. Let's try the holy water. 
Okay, cool buff. Well, we're done with the quest, but so we know there's no more room battles, but there's got to be some stuff in here, right? I mean, we got quite a bit of stress on some people. Hmm. Okay, what are these guys? No dodge, no speed. They're really resistant to stun, but everything else looks pretty good. They've got 14 hit points. Let's try for the bleed. Resistant, of course. Um, I don't know what you do, but you do have a 50% stun chance or resistance. So does he. You've already went. Let's go with this. Let's see if you can get it. Resistant. All right. Um, what's your blight chances? 10, 10, 10. Shocker has 10 hit points. You have eight. You have eight as well. Let's. Hmm. We know the bleed's gonna bleed out for four, so that's gonna give us six. So. Should we go for the stun? I'm feeling the stun again. Resist it. Oh. Gargling grab. Nine. Ten stress. Oh. Heal? Yes, for one! Such a great heal. Gargling grab. Dodge. Nice dodge. That kind of makes up for the shitty heal. Um. Yeah, transform, man. Transform. Alright, got more stress on everybody. I want you to do a raid. That was beautiful. I mean, that could have not asked for anything better there. Um. If we blight him, he's dead. I'm happy with that. Can we get a bleed here? Excellent. Yeah, they're all dead. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Excellent. Uh, basically, why I'm the way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Ooh. Um, what can we do here? What can we do? We've got some food we can eat. You know what? I'll take that. So basically, I'm trying to make more money out of this. We know there's nothing in these rooms, so... Literally, nothing. Did we get a scout? Yes! Alright, so we have a battle here. Two curios. We have a couple of traps. We could use as traps for stress relief. If we can disarm them. 70, 50, 60, 70. Alright, so give it a shot. Obviously you fail, cause... And give us more stress. Okay. That's just how we roll. Yeah, let's eat some food. What do we got here? Hmm. A torch? A bandage? Anti venom? Just grab it? <laughs> um. I guess. And we got some stress relief out of that? I'm okay with that. Slide the torch. I don't really know why. Another completely empty room. Okay, so these rooms, they don't have curios in them. That's fine. We have another chance to get some stress relief here. We got a backpack. There's a map inside. Well, we already had a map of the whole place. Disarmed. Some stress relief. Thank you. And some heirlooms and some money. And that's it. I think we're pretty good. I'm not going to backtrack to go for these two. This other battle is just going to give us way more stress. And Ultimately, having two people stressed out isn't nearly as bad. He kind of took care of himself in this. 
I never really got the opportunity to use the camping skill. I forgot that you can't camp just anywhere. You have to do a longer quest to do so. So we weren't able to remove the disease, last, but that's okay. Wholesome marine life can flourish. If indeed there is such a thing. Wow, I think we made out of like a bandit with these heirlooms here. Alright, let's see what our guys got. Weapon Tinker? Okay. Eldritch Hater. Oh, come on, you already have some bad stuff. Minus 10 stress. Oh, good. We had to get one, huh? Don't know what that does. That's stout. Okay. All in all, I would say that was pretty successful. Our first mission into the coves. Even oh. these dirt covered dullards. Seasoned laborers have been lo Put them to work. loath to make the journey along the old road. Ah, I can't read. Historically, seasonal laborers have been loath to make the journey along the old road, but harsh economic conditions have driven them to desperation. Free upgrade building. Excellent. All right, we got the lazy eye quirk removed. It got rid of the rabies and the scurvy. Underwent effective disease treatment. Diseases cured rabies. And it got rid of them all. Okay, so. Our guys are all pretty much disease-free, except for Jubert here. Oh, we were going to try to get rid of the disease, but <laughs> it didn't work out that way. Hey, guys, thanks for watching. Next time we are going to continue in. Let's get a little sneak peek on that next time, actually, before we get out of here. So our cove, we got a Houndmaster-only weapon. Um, a stun skill chance of the Dazzling Charm on the wheel. That looks pretty promising. Ruins, we got... Ooh. Move resist heavy boots. Move resist ten percent protect minus two speed. That would be good for frontliners. Ah, I'm liking this one. Explore ninety percent rooms. We're not up to level three yet, so we can't do that. Um, that's gonna be a toss up between these two. We'll have to take a look at the team. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.